Hey y'all, Matt from TPSTool.com. We've got a, uh, an interesting one here for you. This is from a, a Cummins diesel, a 5.9 liter. Part number is 560-28184AB. Uh, so if you're using that part number, uh, this is what you can do. Um, so this guy's got some really thick pins you can see in there. And one is smaller than the rest. That's this guy right here in this corner is smaller than the others. So that's pin one. So here's our schematic, what we're going to do. So um, pull this up here. There we go. So the way we're going to connect it is uh, pin one is the small pin. We're going to connect uh, the feedback to pin three, ground to pin four, and five volts to pin five. And I'll show you what that looks like. Uh, so into the TPS tools is how we have it connected. Black and ground, red and feedback, and green and five volts. And since these are so thick and hard to connect to, I've used uh, some alligator clips here just as a helper. This is easier to get to the pins. Uh, so what we're going to do here is pick this guy up. And the small pin, again, is pin one. Looking through the camera and over to the side. So uh, pin three is the feedback. It's going to be our red one. So the pin three is goes one, two, three. So it's going to be the, the top left here. So we're going to stick that guy there. Then pin four is going to be the ground. That's going to be the top right one. So we're going to use, whoops, use our black one over here. And then the one below that, pin five, is going to be our five volts. So we're going to connect that here to this guy here. I know it looks awful crowded in there. Uh, there's enough room. So there we go. If we got it right, turn this guy on. There we go. So there's the reading, uh, completely uh, not attached to the throttle body or anything. And you'll see here as I turn the throttle position sensor, you'll see the numbers change. There we go. And there's full throttle. And we'll come all the way back down. If you had this mounted on the engine, uh, these are on there fairly sturdy. You can mount that up to the engine and set it however you need or uh, do whatever you need to do to it. But again, that's how you attach it to a Cummins Diesel TPS. And I hope this helps somebody. Comments and questions are welcome. Please like and subscribe. Thanks.